So I'm about to go to the Ritzy Fancy Schmancy Bath and Body Works. It's in B Cave. It's at a Galleria. It's at a Galleria. So if you're not subscribed to the channel right now, right now is the time to subscribe. Make sure your notification bell is on. So anytime I upload in this thing, you are alerted. So yeah, it's the um, Galleria. Um, and I am excited to actually see what they have in here. Um, since it's being a little hoity toity place, hopefully they got some really nice stuff. It's currently eight o'clock in the morning. I did not wake up and do the 5 a.m. thing. As a lot of people on IG are already up at the store showing what day two has to offer. I'm just not there yet, y'all. After all the shenanigans yesterday, Lord, I need a coffee before I even start today. Like, seriously, in car, get out my way. Like, so we're gonna go there. We're gonna see what they have. Hopefully, they got some good stuff. Um, since it is day two and a lot of stuff sold out yesterday, I'm hoping to see something different. Um, I seen that online completely sold out. I don't know if they restocked yes this morning. I haven't even been on the site yet. Like, seriously, it's been like i tried to take a mental bath and body works break for a few minutes um while i slept <laughs> and as you can see i have all the fenty yes i washed her and i'm wearing the fenty onesie like i have another onesie actually coming it's not from fenty though it's um the uh baby yoda i have a baby yoda one coming so i'm like yeah baby yoda so my baby yoda one i ordered from cole it should be here soon and that's like my Christmas gift to myself. Like I'm loving jumpers. Like at first, I used to think this is so childlike, but y'all, once you get in a jumper, once you're behind getting a jumper, honey, you're so comfortable, you don't even care what people think. All right, so we are at the Bath and Body Works in the little ritzy rich area. Y'all look, there is hardly like nothing going on right now absolutely nothing and no line how you doing no line so let's see if they put out uh the new stuff right now for day two or not. first walk into this store basically they're giving us a glimpse into spring uh so the start of the next floor set as far as candles was the first thing that i saw then on the other side they did have some of the white barn um collection and i believe this is the is this the newer color run yeah because i seen that orange one peppermint marshmallow my store had it see i had to give y'all my live reaction to how i felt about it and y'all see i said my store right anytime a store have what i like or something i'm searching for it becomes my store even though i don't even live over here <laughs> in my store <laughs> This is where me and my mom came to and we got some real nice semi annual sale stuff Y'all remember that when we went to the rich side of town I called this the rich side of town because it is it's by dripping springs If you've been to dripping springs, you know how expensive it is to live over there And this is kind of like the part of austin where like um Sandra bullock lives near and stuff like that So these huge huge behind mansions are out here in um by lakeway and stuff the hill country They like to call it. So yeah, this is the rich area this is it so yeah they had some of the other collections that we already saw if things are kind of like dupe collections i'm kind of not going to be showing them um so you'll see it this time around but as we get into the other stores you will not and that candle made me nervous y'all i had to push that candle back look <laughs> i was way too nervous about that all right guys so i figured okay Okay, Bath and Body Works stuff, unpinning. I figured I'd take y'all to a mall, give y'all some mall action. I know I took y'all to um, the, uh, where did I take y'all to? I took y'all to, um, what was it? The Outlet Mall, okay. We went to the Outlet Mall, but we haven't been to a mall mall. So we're about to go to the Barton Creek Mall in Austin, Texas. Let me share my drink with y'all. Cheers, first off, cheers okay now the notes in this is um this is the sugar cookie almond latte um i have five shots of sugar-free vanilla and i have two splenda in it this combo is so good the location don't open to nine we're about 12 miles out mm -mm -mm. 
this is lovely all right guys so we made it to the barton creek mall um so let's see what this bath and body works has so no line here as well started like this i looked over to the left mm, all the new candles was looking at me i looked over to the left hmm. <laughs> okay so all these new candles will stare me in the face all the new candles i've been seeing people talk about on instagram maybe it'll come out day two maybe it won't and y'all look at them they here they here look at them cozy cashmere all of it the mimosa what's good mimosa all of them are here in the words of armand wiggins get in here get in here okay so get in here get in here to that location because they got all the new new and you see they only had a few of the pomegranate lemonade ones and the crazy thing is as you can see it was only a few people in the store it was me and a couple of the people that was it and i loved it because i got there right when they opened they opened at nine it was 904 when i got there so i loved it like i didn't get up extra early this morning the first day i got up extra early because i was super excited it was day one plus i need it in the stars only thing i i'll talk about it in tomorrow's video my biggest regret um yeah but yeah i woke up five o'clock in the morning to get in the stars and uh i got one and we're gonna leave it at that but anyway <laughs> um they had some of the blasts from the past i like to call them and really the past is just you know some candles from earlier this year they had those out because of course it's candle day they're trying to diminish all of this they're trying to get rid of all of this because they're looking at 2022 i cannot believe we're about to be in 2022 next month like this is crazy to me next month will be 2022 I am not ready. I am not. And I love the way they have all the candle holders just displayed so perfectly. I love that they have so many bears still available. Such a nice thing to see, to see our polar bear being treated properly. So if y'all have not purchased y'all royal bear, go ahead and purchase it. Because last year they were hard to come by and they was gone. It was gone. Now we keep seeing them like crazy. So get one. All right. I'm nosy. I can't help it. So I went to the Pflugerville location just to look and browse, um, not to buy anything but to look and browse. But I do have uh, $10 on my Ibotta, so I might walk out with a can. It's free. <laughs> was a browse lie okay first thing i seen they had give hope at this location so they had give hope and then the next thing i seen is i ran into two subscribers carmen and carmen what's good i ran into them at the store it was a mother and daughter duo i was like oh it was so nice to see them together and them just taking a moment to speak with me definitely if you see me just stop and say hi i know it kind of gets a little awkward sometimes for people but i mean we're all people at the end of the day that loves the same thing i ain't no celebrity y'all i was there in my pajamas just chilling enjoying myself so if you see me just say hey um but as you seen they had new candles as well and they brought back the summer of last year collection as well so we're back guys back at the house i wanted to go ahead and show you what i got from each store um and then after this video there's one more video it's gonna be the haul in after dark video for candle day that i did last night with my mom because i know y'all want a mom video it's gonna be out tonight because the haul in after dark video so it'll be fit to go at night and get uploaded at night so let's get started um the first store i picked up only two candles and of course as y'all see my reaction um in the store yeah it's the give hope this is the peppermint marshmallow i don't know why a lot of stores don't have it i'm thinking it wasn't shipped in enough time for it to get to the stores by candle day so a lot of stores don't have it it has a red wax really really pretty i love the jar and it smells really good the notes is crushed peppermint fluffy marshmallows powdered sugar people were on the hunt like crazy for this bad boy so i went ahead and picked up two i was only going to get one and i said ah, 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 you better not go ahead and get two so i went ahead and got two of them so that's that um i'm going to skip to the last store then we're going to go to the middle store at the second store of course if you guys also not using your ibotta not using your fetch 
you need to be because um, yesterday that video I showed you from the outlet only paid eight dollars out of pocket because I had fetch reward card available telling y'all use that stuff it is beneficial because this um, transaction only paid for one candle because I had ten dollars and like 20 cents on my Ibotta so I used my Ibotta of course to pay and boom I only had to pay for one candle so it was I only what paid five something a candle if you break it down like that because one candle was free. So I'm telling y'all, y'all better be using that stuff. So cookies with Santa. I actually got this for my mom because y'all are gonna see in this evening's video how she's hinting that she really wants this. So I'm adding it in with some of her stuff for Christmas. <sighs> cookies with Santa, okay? It's fresh cinnamon, brown sugar, a drop of vanilla, okay? So it's very, very pretty. She wanted it, so of course, in Tina fashion, I made sure my mama had it. And then at that location, because it was the Pflugerville location, just so if you guys know and you live in the Austin area, I also picked up Wild Berry Jam Donut. New packaging. Yes. I don't know if this is the spring release or whatever, but it was out today, okay? Sweet Wild... Ooh, ooh. Back it up. Back, back, back it up. All ish. $26.50 is the price point on this candle. Can y'all see that? Oh, no. Even some of the Bath & Body Works ones are saying $26.50 for the new ones. What? Mm -mm -mm. $26.50 is the price point on this one. Wow. Wow. I should have looked at all the rest of the new ones that they all had that price point too. So, ooh, if you see it today. Get it today, $26.50, okay. So I got that, but I got some new ones. Well, a lot of the newer ones that's supposed to come out in the next collection. I got this at the Barton Creek Mall. Got a whole crate. It went in there for one or two and ended with a whole crate, okay? So the first one we have here, and it's the price at $25.50, just so you guys know, is the Pomegranate Lemonade. Pretty packaging. I love the packaging on it. The notes is juicy pomegranate, zesty lemons, sugar crystals. It smells just like that. It's nothing else to say. It's good to have at least one in your collection. I picked up a vanilla and peach tea. We all know the throw on vanilla and peach tea is not that great, <laughs> but every time I get it anyway, I get it anyway because I don't care that it's light. I don't care. And the packaging. If you guys can see it, there you go. It's really, really pretty. The price point on this one is also $25.50, so it's not showing the $26.50. Um, the next one I have here is, y'all know it's hard for me to get them out because my nails, these long behind nails. This is laundry day. Oh my goodness, it's $25.50 is the price point. The packaging is everything, look at that. And it's textured. It's like a soft sweater. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. Oh, I'm so happy to get my hands on laundry day. I seen it. I was like, oh my God, this is so cozy looking and so pretty. And it smells so, so good. It smells like laundry day. Like you just washed all the clothes and everything. Oh, yes, laundry day. Yes. So I picked that up. Um, what's the next one in here? This one surprised me that I picked it up because when I seen it online, I was like, no, nah, I don't want it. But it's $25.50, not online, but when I seen it, well, I did see it online. I seen it on Instagram, duh. So when I seen it on Instagram, I was like, nah, because Blush Poinsettia, who wants that? But, uh, is that my house right now? It's here. It made it home. Um, the notes of this is rose petals, green ivy, sweet marshmallow, and it smells good. I didn't even know cap. It ain't my pink petal tea cake. It's not pink petal tea cake, but it's really good. And for it to be a rose scent and I like it, yeah, that says something about it. So, yeah, y'all need this. This is good. This is from a non-rose lover. Don't like rose stuff. This is good. Um, so, that's definitely a win. The next one I got, and I should have got two of these, but then I was like, no, because I have it in so many different packaging. Um, so, I'm like, nah. But this is the Cozy Cashmere. Cozy Cashmere looks just like that. I love this packaging. It's really, really pretty. Um, the price point on this one is $25.50. Color is like this grape kind of color going on, and I really do dig it. I think it's really cool. 
and cozy cashmere smells amazing so happy to have that one i should have got a second one instead of getting this one but i end up getting this one well no 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 i take that back because i love this one hold on i take that back and i'm about to review this this is the toasted hazelnut praline looks just like that price point is the 25.50 right yeah 25.50 y'all I don't want to spoil my review, but this is similar to pumpkin peanut brittle. Yes. So I had to have a third one. I had to. And I had it going yesterday and I'm like, oh my goodness, this just puts me in the mindset of pumpkin peanut brittle. And you know, they didn't bring that back this year. And I wonder if this is the reason why they didn't bring it back. But, oh, okay, top. Okay, top. Am I spilling Bath and Body Works secrets? Okay. <laughs> But I wonder if that's the reason why they didn't bring it back because they were going to bring out Toasted Hazelnut Praline and they are very eerily similar, like very, very similar. This one is just lighter. Yeah. So that's it, guys. Candle Day 2021 is a wrap over here at the channel. I will have a video up probably tomorrow. My final thoughts of the sale. It'll probably go up with Candle News Network. Well, no, it'll probably be its own separate video. I'll make it its own separate video. Um, just my final thoughts of the sale, what I thought about the lines, what I thought about one line selling out the first day as we knew it would. Um, but we're going to talk about all that. We're going to talk about the Canadian site, having things we didn't have on the U.S. site. Yes, um, Tebow fan brought it to my attention that the Canada site was lit and our site was trash. Okay, so we're going to talk about all that tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Enjoy the rest of your candle day. Tonight, you will see mom. So make sure your notification bell's on so you can catch her in all her glory at Candle Day. And I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.